guys, Sarah here with Chicago Music Exchange. I'm here today with Idiot, hailing from Indianapolis. And I'm stoked to ask you all some questions. Thanks for coming in today. Thanks for Thank you. Us. Yeah. yeah. Thanks for having us. Love the name, first of all. Is there a backstory? <laughs> uh, my <laughs> wife came up with it, I will say that. So, yeah, big thanks to Amanda. Uh, <laughs> there was a I lot of know. bad options that we yeah. were rolling through. Mm. <laughs> I, I think, think I think <laughs> you were just like, what about idiot? And you're like, oh, great. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I like it. It's punchy. Yeah. It's yeah. just like straight up. I think me and Thomas say, uh, oh, I'm a fucking idiot all the time. And yeah. I think that's where it happened. Yeah. That's awesome. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about JML guitars. Are you required to play one if you are in <laughs> Idiot? No. Uh, I'm, I'm playing now. Um, but no. No requirement. Okay. No. It's just an option. But it would be like preferred, right? I mean, <laughs> they, they both yeah. They both yeah. play one. Carl has one. I just one, got one. And he didn't play it today. No. No. Yeah. Okay. I need to do, so a, do a couple things to get it. <laughs> That's fair. Yeah. Got to get done. it tuned up, ready to go. Yeah. I understand. J JML, though, is kind of how this band started, though. Kind of. Yeah. Ooh, tell me more about that. Is the, these, you three were all working at the shop. Yeah, so Dylan makes cases. Uh, Thomas worked with me for a long time making guitars. I'm JML. Brian owns a very early JML. Uh, yeah. We rode bikes together, what? and yeah. you were writing songs, mm -hmm. and I was it's like, right, yeah. yeah, if you want to do that, I would love to I, play music, and then it just kind of became yeah, a pandemic thing. You know? Yeah, so I sent a garage band MP3, and then you pl I think you, you said you played it in the shop, mm -hmm. and then Dylan was there, and it was, I kept getting texts saying, I want to be in this band. I was like, this isn't a band, it's just like, well, like I, they just it made some now. songs in my basement, and then yeah. we made it a band. And, and Carl joined us, and Tom I, I got and those recordings when I was still living that's in true. North Carolina. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's a pretty cool trajectory. Yeah. So it yeah. kind of started as like a casual yeah. pandemic project yeah. of sorts, yeah. and then yeah. well, let's be okay. So Brian plays in another band where they use a lot of gear, and the initial <laughs> intention was to play in a band where you did not use as much gear. <laughs> yes, yeah. that's, that was and important. So you're like, I just want to play my Rick through this Marshall and play Nirvana covers. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah. that's it was called Nirvana. We, we called it Nirvana. <laughs> yeah, it was, yeah. Yeah. was that with like uh, a G in? Or? Yeah, yeah. Okay, was, yeah. I like that. That's, that's good. True. I forgot. I forgot we called it Nirvana. Yeah. It's still <laughs> labeled that in my phone. Yeah, same. <laughs> <laughs>
don't you have a bass player? That's what we all really want to know. Mm, it's 18 strings <laughs> are better than 16. Uh, <laughs> I've always kind of played So it's that all about way. math. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. Our old bands, I, I played in that weird low tuning all the time. Yeah. He was, was the just, only guitarist. Yeah. That's sort of... No bass, no other six string. Yeah. It was just him mm -hmm. playing through two yeah. stacks. And you don't want to hear me play like a regular guitar because it's terrible. So, uh, <laughs> well, yeah, because yeah. I can't. You guys were doing uh, Smothers, right? Yes. Yeah. And so he already had gear set up in the rehearsal space, like both sides of his ring. So I just yeah. came over and plugged into one side, and he took we the started. Side. Yeah, yeah, we started yeah. practicing that way, and then we were like, "Do we need a bass player?" And we're like, we don't know. "No, it sounds <laughs> pretty good." Like we, so. don't. we still don't. Yeah. Will you ever have one? No, mm -hmm. cool. so. we'd probably go with another guitarist. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I like that. More guitarist. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Never yeah. enough of those. Yeah. I'm gonna just make a double neck, maybe. Yeah. Ooh, twelve string. Make yeah. your drums Ooh. guitars. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I need to find a perfect place. A win. I don't know. Anymore. You're asking the wrong people. <laughs> yeah. You guys aren't in the scene? Oh, like 20 years ago we were. Uh, yeah. I, I've probably, I mean, Brian and I have been in bands consistently. Dylan yeah. was too, yeah. but I don't, you know, I mean, it's, it goes through, you know, ebbs and flows. Mm -hmm. um, it's better than it ever has been since I've lived there since 2004. Right oh, really? Now. In terms of what? Just like more activity or? Um, there's just a lot more venues. Better, yeah, cool. Venues, a lot yeah. more bands. Um, I mean, when I when I moved to Indy in 2004, I already knew like a lot of people from the hardcore scene or the metal scene, cool. and like so it was pretty small it seemed like. But most of the time going to shows now, like I don't know, you know, two thirds of the people. It's amazing. That's mm -hmm. wild. Um, it's really rad to see communities develop around music. Yeah. And yeah, it's, it's healthy. So it's also really cool. I think 
there's still a, there's still a as we started this band started playing out there's a lot of younger bands too mm -hmm. that are in the hardcore scene that has been it's been really fun to see that that scene is still alive mm -hmm. and be able too. to still participate in it it's super yeah. cool if you're gonna tell people like a reason to visit indianapolis other than to like see you guys mm -hmm. what would you suggest oh, you know I, well, there's a we have a really good coffee scene Mm -hmm. Ooh, okay. Uh, okay. I know that sounds like I'm making a joke, but there's a lot of really good coffee and uh, coffee shops. You know, just coffee. Uh, Coffee's in, good. In general, a lot of. Yeah. If you had to break it down and distill it into one word, well, what like, would you say? Would you say coffee? So, <laughs> so it's a good place to get caffeinated yeah. Yeah. and yeah. see yeah. a hardcore show. Sure, yeah. If At you wanted the same to have a time. nice time without it being too exciting, it's mm -hmm. a good time. I like that. It sounds really, really, really nice, to be honest. I also feel like I'm struggling to answer that question not as like a dad. Yeah. Like, oh, you can take your kids to the children's yeah. museum. Yeah. It's, uh, it's great for families. It is great for families. Family yeah. friendly. Yes. Very family friendly. Coffee, hardcore. <laughs> a question but i was looking through the curtain earlier while you guys were playing and i do really love the lamps and i'm kind of bummed that they're not out here anymore so but can you tell me a little bit about the lamps one, <laughs> first of all the penmanship on them is beautiful whose handiwork is that i searched uh idiot in cursive online <laughs> after we named <laughs> Isn't the internet amazing? Our band. Yeah, so it cool. really is. You can truly find anything. <laughs> and there's this <laughs> random <laughs> shot of a letter that looks like it's 100 years old, and it said, you uh, effing idiot. Yeah. <laughs> and it was underlined, and it's and all I did was blow it up, and it's exactly it. The Just underline? Them, yeah. Them. Like, look at this. <laughs> there, yeah. There it is. It's beautiful. Um, is there a story behind the lamp bases? These also look like they'd be at home in a grandmother's cozy coke den. I think they were just goodwill. Yeah, they were yeah. Just should, we let, fine, yeah. should we let the yeah. lamp answer? <laughs> <laughs> goodwill lamps. Did you get that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> Now's a great time also to shout out like your social media or where people should go to learn more about you if they want to check out more of your music. Do you want to drop some of those uh, here to the end? <laughs> 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 Idiot yeah. Yeah. Idiot underscore band. Band. Yeah. Got, band. Yeah. We got a. Idiot sucks. <laughs> not band. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, no. It's, <laughs> it's crazy. There's a lot of idiots out there. So I want to yeah. make people That's so true aware. <laughs> so it's there's just, all lower. I want to make sure people find band. the right idiot. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. So it's idiot dot band for. There's an Instagram and yep. then the the demo is on Bandcamp and it's idiot sucks dot Bandcamp dot com. Well, thanks y'all for coming in today. We hope you had fun. Yeah. yeah. I had fun chatting with y'all. Isn't it rad? Yeah, we hope you come back. Awesome. Bring the lamps. It the lamps magical. are awesome. Uh, all right, guys. Idiot from Indianapolis. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>